let us now solve question number 20 of gate 2018. A steel is plastically worked in a temperature range below the nose of the TTT curve and above martensite star temperature that is MS followed by quenching to produce fine martensite. What is this process called? The options given are option A mark tempering, option B os forming, option C intercritical forming and option D normalizing. So before going for the answer, let me briefly discuss each process. This is the TTT diagram explaining mark tempering process. The first step in mark tempering process involves heating the steel above osnatizing temperature that is A3 followed by quenching to the temperature just above the martensite star temperature. So once the uniform temperature is ensured throughout the sample, it is then subjected to air cooling and the desirable microstructure for this process is 100% martensite. So air cooling must be fast enough to prevent the formation of other microstructures such as brain heat. This smart tempering process does not involve any mechanical working. Let me explain os forming process. In os forming, the steel is heated above osnatizing temperature that is A3, super cool to the temperature below the nose of pearlitic C curve that is here. This metastable martensite is deformed heavily and it has to be made sure that no transformation happens during this deformation process. This deformed metastable austenite is then quenched to form a completely martensitic structure. This process involves mechanical deformation and the final microstructure is 100% martensite. In case of intercritical forming, the samples are heat treated to the temperature between A1 and A3 and it is then subjected to forming simultaneously on cooling. And as the result of intercritical forming, the resultant heat treated steel will have a dual phase microstructure. So, it will not have complete martensite microstructure. As we know that normalizing process involves heating the steel to the temperature above osnatizing temperature that is A3 and after holding it for a proper time, it is cooled in still air or slightly agitated air. And normalizing technically does not involve any mechanical deformation. So, option D is also not correct. As we have seen, mark tempering does not involve any mechanical working and intercritical forming will not produce 100% martensite. Normalizing also does not involve any mechanical working. The correct answer for this question is option B that is horse forming. Thank you.